Hey, what's up, everybody? Um, uh, I wanted to just do a quick video, and I apologize. Uh, um, <laughs> I, uh, I'm really terrible. Well, it would help if I actually had more clothes. I, I mean, I guess I do have more clothes, but I'm really picky when it comes to what I like to wear. Like at home, I like to I try to avoid a shirt at all, and if I do, it's a tank top. But um, I apologize. I I only have my wife beater that is currently clean. Um, if I didn't shower earlier, I wouldn't mind so much. Well, it's not like it even matters. I, I, I was going to say, I, I would have put on like a an old um, tank top. Um, but I have everything in the wash because I, I kind of neglected to do my laundry. So uh, uh, I could wait for it to be finished. But I'm I'm. it's almost 9 o'clock. I'm getting sleepy. There's like another 40 minutes on it. So I at least wanted something where I'm not naked. Well, I'm shirtless, I guess, not naked. Um, so I apologize. Um, but, yeah, I don't know. I just wanted to do a quick video. Again, just to kind of get in the habit of doing videos. Um, but I, I guess today was also just a really good day, too. Um, I, I guess the first thing is uh, an update with the leg. Um, uh, like, workouts and mechanics behind it. Uh I uh, surprisingly I was able to actually lift um, a decent amount more um, uh, today. I ended up um, the the heaviest set that I did was um, twenty pound twenty five pound plate and a ten pound plate, so a total of thirty five, which is actually pretty solid considering that you know on Saturday when I did it, you know I think I got to like twenty five. Um, and I did do a few more sets too of like heavier weights. So it's actually a, a pretty significantly noticeable increase in my, uh, the amount of weight I was able to lift, um, and the amount of volume I was able to, uh, kind of crank out with that. Um, so that's super cool. Um, uh, I'm really glad. And, and, you know, it just seems like my fitness has been going pretty well anyways. Uh, like I just weighed myself too, and I'm down to... Uh, 199. Uh, I, I try not to go by weight too much because it fluctuates. Um, I, I don't think weight, at least if you're weighing yourself daily, is a really good indicator of um, your progress. Uh, but still nice to know. But it's like, uh, yeah, because I had gotten down to 187 for a while, but then I got this gym membership and I kind of gained weight again. Uh, but more from just like working out, um, not necessarily muscle fibers, but just muscle fullness, um, you know, uh, body's response to the exercise, like probably more glycogen stores, um, as a result also of glycogen, you know, a little more water, um, so on and so forth. Um, but yeah, so that's, that's super awesome. But, um, I guess, um, uh, I kind of wanted more to make this video because it's just like, I'm super stoked with the recovery coaching thing that I've been doing. Um, so today I did end up getting two more matches, uh, which is great. Um, I reached out to them later, um, late in the, e a few hours ago. So like kind of late ish in the evening. Um, but one already called me and we worked out a time. So we'll be meeting on Thursday over the phone, which is super cool. But in the second one, I haven't heard back from him, but either way, um, it's cool because um, I think I mentioned one of the peers, uh, we had our last meeting last week because he is going to go on to do recovery coaching on his own uh, through the same uh, organization. And the policy is if you're doing coaching, you know, you can't employ a coach uh, for yourself, which makes sense because it's like kind of uh, the blind uh, leading the blind in a way. Um, so, um, you know, I, I, before that happened, I did have six. So now I was kind of back down to, uh, five, but now with these two, so I'm at seven, well, provided the other one reaches out or contacts me eventually, which I'm sure he will. Um, so that's super cool. Uh, that'll be nice to have a little additional income so I can buy myself some supplements or something. Um, cause I'm getting low. Um, but um, I, I guess also just, I don't know, it's cool that I'm finally, like, 
able to like I, I I wouldn't say like I feel super accomplished but at least now I feel like I'm actually doing something and something meaningful um and I I guess you know it's just kind of cool to get feedback from the person that does the the match in with the peers and the recovery coach um because apparently a lot of my peers um I've been getting good feedback um from a lot of my peers uh so it's just cool to know you know, I don't need that external validation, um, but at the same time, it is nice to get feedback, whether that's, you know, positive feedback or more negative, like constructive criticism feedback. Um, either way, I, I enjoy getting feedback so that way I can do my job or do my task, whatever I'm doing, much better. Um, and sometimes, you know, constructive criticism is worth more than compliments, um, but again like either way it's just cool to know that yeah i'm doing something right and you know from the sounds of it, the peers are benefiting to some degree or at least you know it's something partially meaningful <laughs> you know it's not just like an hour of just like bsing around like you know um kind of walking alongside them in their own quests uh journeys of recovery and you know just kind of supporting them as a peer uh, which I also really enjoy because, you know, it's not like from a position of more authority, uh, you know, like if I was, uh, their substance counselor or their sponsor or, you know, even their nurse, um, I get to be myself and be genuine and share parts of my story. Um, uh, granted, you know, it's not this, you know, when I meet with them, it's their time. It's not my time. So I don't divulge too much but it's cool though that if they do ask questions or if there is something that I can relate to I can share that and be truthful um so I I, I don't know I just think that's so cool um and again just like finally starting to get a good amount of peers uh because it ultimately comes down to more than than the money um I mean additional money is nice because I, I can buy myself nice things but uh, it's just nice to also, like, work with more people and feel like I'm doing more. Um, so, yeah, I'm just, I'm super stoked about that. But uh, everything's, yeah, everything's just, like, going fantastic. I, uh, uh, like I said earlier today, was a, has been a really good day. Um, my color got called on the color line, so I had to go down in, in UA. Um, I was going to between um, after the gym and meeting with my peer one of the peers today at four, but, um, I decided to just head back home so I could be home in time instead of, I was going to go to the place where I do the UA and then bust it back home and then meet with my peer. But I was afraid that I was going to cut it a little close. So I didn't, um, but it was cool. My housemate, Mike, um, offered to drive me there. Uh, and so he did, which, uh, helped a lot, saved a lot of time. And, and we also stopped at the store. So it was nice to be able to buy, um, a little bit of groceries and not have to like haul it back on foot or, um, you know, on a bike. So yeah, I, I just, it's, I'm just really appreciative of, of how good life is, or at least my current situation especially in contrast to, you know, this time three years ago. I mean, uh, when I was deep in my nitrous oxide binge, um, you know, getting pretty close to when I, I first had the onset of uh, nerve damage and um, couldn't walk. I mean, so the fact that I'm able to do all this stuff and live this relatively healthy life, um, I, I'm just, I'm just like internally grateful for it. Um, you know, when things could have played out a lot differently. Um, and it's cool too, just to, like to regain, it's more than just like my physical health and my mental health, like regain, I don't know, just like being, being like a contributing person to the world, um, you know, actually doing something um, other than just dicking around all day. Um, but it's still nice though. Uh, what I also like about this coaching is I still get that time to, you know, work on my recovery and I can spend time going to the gym where I can spend time, you know, going to meetings, um, doing my treatment. So I'm really thankful for that too, that like where I'm not just working full time, uh, and I don't have 
as much time to dedicate as time or energy to dedicate to my recovery so um yeah i don't know so i just want to make a video and just like just a quick kind of a recap of today and you know how the the leg workout stuff is going uh because i think like i said in the other video i think that'll be a kind of an interesting experiment or this will be an interesting experiment to uh see how that goes because you know it's possible that you know maybe i won't be able to gain back much more strength than what i've already gotten uh which i would be fine with i mean that would kind of suck but considering i can at least still do squats and like walk and stuff like um you know i, I count my blessings um but it'll be cool to see if i i can still continue to build that and just i don't know um and and yeah, I just wanted to do a video for consistency's sake. I I don't think I did one yesterday. Did I? No, I don't think so. I don't remember. Um, <laughs> I think it's been a day or two since I made my last video. I could check right now, but I, I'm not going to waste your guys' time. Um, all I know is at least over the past like 10 days I've done... Actually, this is probably the most um, content or most... Uh, the most videos I put out in like a 10 day period. I hope to continue. I, I do still again want to like do a more in depth video about my full experience with the nitrous oxide just because I think that that has probably been the most helpful to people. Um, at least, you know, from reading the comments, that's what it seems to be the most like reason or help that, you know, people are watching the video. So. Uh, but now I'm rambling. This is why I wanted to kind of do this video now instead of late, wait until my laundry's finished. Um, I probably shouldn't even do this video, but whatever. Uh, it's my channel. Um, so, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. I'm going to try and do... I'm not going to commit to anything because I I feel like I've done a lot. But I, I'm going to... I would like to make another video in the next few days. I, I don't know about what. Maybe just uh, another check-in. But uh, regardless, just to get in that habit. So... Um, yeah, so thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, I hope everyone is having a good week, uh, and I'll see you guys next time.